everybody, welcome back to another episode of Funky Steve's Medinas. So we left the last planet that we were on um, after pulling off another mission. It was a really simple one. We made a, we made a million sea bills roughly on it, which was enabled us to jump uh, 26 days to get to where we are now. Uh, we're at uh, Harafen. Um, and let's just have a look, quick look at the star map here. So it's a three and a half, three and a half skull um, ghost bear controlled world. Lunar planet, we were over here. Um, Barahona, we just jumped over to here. So we're going to have a look here. There's not a lot to do contract-wise. Um, all of our mechs are back now. We've got a new um, catapult up and running, which I'll show you in a minute. Um, we're going to do aggressive negotiations. This is really the only half decent mission we can take against the clans right now. Um, uh, so we're going to negotiate this, and we're going to go for a full salvage on this. We want more clan gear for sure, so we're going to accept it. And we're going to remove our second lance. And we're going to remove this catapult, and we're going to bring in the new one. I think it's the C21, I believe. So the C21 has got a clan LRM20, uh, double plus LRM20 with uh, plus one accuracy and 50% chance for crit hits on it, and two MML7s plus tons of ammunition um, it uh, does have an XL engine I believe so we need to be careful with this guy at a distance and an ultralight engine or a gyro I mean so he's not as stable but with a pirate TC with uh, um, plus three accuracy with ranged weapons um, it's got plus one recoil with ranged weapons but we've also got this guy in here the plus four accuracy with indirect fire so that should really help out at a distance and let's bring in our main lance again, so Savage Steve, and Hellcat, um, Rhino, and where are you here, Rocky. Alright, let's do this. Alright, here we go. Lunar environment should favor us, I think, overall. That looks like a catapult. That's the boss. And we've got reinforcements on this side over here. Oh, Darius. So we need to smash the guys over here first, definitely. I remember fighting on this map before and having to take a retreat. So let's see how this goes. If we can focus fire down the first couple threats, that would be good. Commander? I don't want you to be too visible. I mean, you can be doing more damage direct fire-wise, but... Uh, and it does have full armor. The catapult's got full armor, so it's pretty well protected, but... It can also be targeted relatively simply. Okay, let's see where they are. Adder, Nova Cat, Stinger, Wolverine 2. Oh shoot, I was targeting the wrong guy here. So 54% on this guy. Wow. Pretty darn good chances to hit. Two times 20. Let's see if we can just wipe out this thing. I might as well just do it. Yep. Yep. I don't know how fast these guys are. Ready for order. Uh, you need to reserve. Because I want to get eyes on first. 
with somebody. Okay, here comes that Wolverine. Full Steve ahead. All right, got eyes on with this guy, Nova Cat. At her. This guy's already gone. Yeah, I think we want this guy gone. Okay. Wasn't expecting to kill him, but I'll take it. Go against the guy that hasn't gone yet. And fire. Wow. If these guys were full armor, it would be a different story, I'm sure. Taken a hit. Wow, he bailed out. This is the end. What's up, boss? Well, we don't have quite have enough juice to get there, eh? A lot of heat. Let's do it. Ah, I was hoping we hit the T simp, but whatever. 75 ton catapult, eh? Cougar. Commander. Hmm. Let's go this route. Better chance to hit. See if we can remove them. Oh. Inflicted some heavy damage. Okay. So now we got a chance to see what our catapult is a grinner. See what our catapult can do. Yes, commander. At a distance here. Their catapult appears to be too far, but that's fine. Let's go. Just move into here. Phoenix Hawk, I guess. Wow, the heat's the heat level's insane here. Leave the MMLs off. And yeah, fire. All right, guys, another Grinner. They're just not fast enough to get over here to threaten us before we kill these guys. Oh, okay, he's still going. Oh, I arm hit him too, that's why. At least that catapult, hopefully we can get some clan LRMs off it. Standing by. Copy that. Uh sure, why not? Yep. Half file removed. Lance one gone. Phoenix Hawks the next target. Ready for orders. Got it. Let's let them get in a little closer, I think. Uh, I can't let that go. 
Can't let that go. I'm receiving you. All right, you're pretty hot. Let's move back here for now. So we can get a direct shot on somebody. Really, eh? All right, fire three. Wow. Enemy mech destroyed. Order. I think these guys all must have partial armor. Full speed. No target. Oh, we got a target. This guy right here. Yeah, man. Think I hit something good. Jump away, buddy. So I don't know where this guy gets away on this map. Um, that's a cliff, right? Yeah, so I got to come in through this way. Got it. God, he's not looking well. Um, hmm. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we had to take the shot. Look at that chance to hit, man. All weapons are good. A primary target is taking damage. Okay, this should bring this Grinner to a grinding halt. Yep. Okay, he's not bugging out. Oh, sorry, we haven't ended our turn yet. I thought we ended the turn. I'm here. Yeah, not bugging out. I'm there. You're everywhere. All right, firing. Goodbye. Ouch. Tango down. He's just taking a bit of a dirt nap. Oh, nice shoot, man. Commander, I'm hit. I see that.
what I wouldn't give for a uh, fire starter right about now. Okay. Okay, we got the right leg. Now, question is, do we go for the other leg or do we go for the head? That guy will be overheating. Should be overheating. Yep. What's up, boss? Double time. Okay. Good range for anything here. So the legs got 240. 57%. 9% for the head. Let's see if we can get a headshot on this guy. get knocked down but let's see if we can get the guy with the t -Semp. nicely done uh, don't want to lose those arms I want the LRMs for sure Try for the leg, I guess. Ah, uh, well, we got at least one hit on it. Yes, Commander. On the move. Uh, let's see what we got. I have no idea where that hit. Side torso. Standing by. Acknowledged. Wow. Okay, I'm liking this loadout. Yeah, man. Okay, well, a really good chunk of clan salvage off that. 300000 or is uh, payment, which should more than cover any repairs we have. We did get a head hit, though, so... I mean, not much we can do about that. Yeah, t Semp cannon's damaged. Gotta repair that. It damages itself, though. That's the thing. You gotta be careful with it. Um ton of mech parts clan 15 clan 20 do we take them both maybe damn so much good stuff clan endo steel would definitely help out clan exchanger Jesus uh, what do we take here guys I think we take the LRM-20. Weapon mount, too. Well, maybe we leave the 15 off. Take the 20. Um, Feral Lamellar. Minus 12% pr armor pr protection versus point of armor. 20% reduced damage taken, though. A lot of money to repair the armor, though. We're not really at the point where we'll be fighting assault mechs yet, which is, I think, 
more so where this really comes into play. Although it would be really nice. I mean, we could put it on the frontline punch bot too, right? Yeah. Let's take it. All right, so what do we got here? Adder part, Grinner part, Nova Cat, a couple Stinger parts, Medium Pulse, yeah. Clan Double Heatsink, not too bad. I mean, it could have been a heck of a lot worse. Okay, let's have a look here. Russell Hegg took Turtle Bay from Karita, did they? Okay, 17,000, not bad at all. Okay, let's get these guys fixed. Um, so three days for repair. Let's, yeah, let's go this route. Okay, so let's have a look real quick here at the meal near. I think maybe we switch out. I think it's got an NSS in it, doesn't it? It does. Now, does the NSS, here's my question. Does the NSS, oh, we got to fix the T-SEMP too. Um, where are you here? Does it affect your ability to ECM other people? Huh. Maximum invasion pips is really helpful. Because we're barely being hit now, right? Who's going to benefit from this more? That's the question. Right now, I mean, we don't, we're not really getting hammered by anybody right now. We're doing pretty well. I mean, we haven't punched above our weight quite yet. Yeah. Let's have a look at the victor here real quick. I want to see if there's something that we can do here. We got a clan ultra five. I know we were going to add that. We got a clan rotary five too, right? So if we do, um, let's do this real quick. Rotary five. Um, we need at least one more ton of ammo. At least one. That's for 10 turns of firing. This is 15 turns. Just for the sake of argument, let's leave it like that for now. And then if we go to missile systems. Clan LRM-20. We need two tons of ammo. That's 12 turns. We got a little bit left over too. And we could jump the two light machine guns back in. If we pull out the small laser. Because it's not really doing anything right now. Um, we got four tons left over. How's our heat? Pretty good still. We could go with a clan medium pulse laser.
and with two tons left, we put heat sinks in, uh, or cooling pods even. That should keep us super cool, yeah. I don't know guys, how do you feel about that? Taking the LRM20 out, so the Ultra 5 is doing 40 times 2. 40% chance to jam after firing. Ten percent jam chance of jamming with the ultra. I mean if we this is seven tons. Five percent chance chance to jam. I don't like the fact that this is like 40% chance to jam. It's like every two turns it's going to be jamming. I wish there was a way we could reduce that. Um, so if we don't use the rotary, we could use the Ultra 5. And we could put the LBX 5 in. Right? We'd only need like three tons of ammo then, so we could pull a ton of ammo out. Um, with one ton left over, what do we do? I mean, our heat sinking should still be really good. Yeah. Uh, Now, do we have, yeah, we got a Guardian ECM here. Do we have a better ECM we could drop in? That's the question. Can't use extended cooling. Targeting computer cockpit, plus one with ranged weapons, minus one recoil with ranged weapons, plus one initiative. And the, uh, advanced cockpit, plus one accuracy, 10% reduced damage taken, minus 5% weapon heat generated, maximum heat overheat, plus three initiative. What's the recoil on these guys? Two, so it'll be recoil of one. This thing's got, this one we have recoil of zero. I don't know, I think I like this, the fact that it's reducing recoil. Yeah, I'm going to leave that in for now, I think. Um, mask is four tons, it's not really going to help this guy out that much. Right, we need to put a C3 slave in at some point. Because we need a C3 master. That should probably be in the... Um, that should probably definitely be in the... Uh, let's do this. The master should be in the um, catapult. So let's confirm this. It's eight days. Let's have a look at the catapult here too. Uh, where are you? Still being repaired? Yes, C21. So let's go. Okay. Um, can we get it in here though? That's the question. Uh, Okay, equipment. Where is the C3 master here? Two and a half tons. How do we get two and a half tons? Okay, well, we can start by putting patchwork materials in. Two tons. Um, 
Heat seeking is great. Well, we could change the warfare suite out. Or we reduce the LRM-20, this guy, to a 15. I don't want to do that, though. Should have taken that uh, clan LRM-15. We could put the extended LRM in here. That'll save one ton, and we can pull a ton of ammo out. We can put the damage one in and just repair it as well. Wait, what? Why is this 10? What the hell? Oh, that's why. It's the difference between enhanced and extended. This is 9, this is 10, right? Yeah. Could go for bonus stability damage, bonus LRM damage. Let's try the enhanced LRM. And we pull a ton of ton, we can just pull a ton of ammo out, I think. And that should be fine. I want to try and get case two for this as well. That's four days. We moved the laser AMS over here. Still four days. Uh, let's do that. Actually, maybe we put this in the cen center torso. Yeah, let's try this. How much is this thing? Three tons. Yeah, we'll go this route. Let's just confirm this. Right. I'll get it in the schedule. All right. Let's, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to end the episode here, guys. Um, so that's just kind of my thought layout wise for these mechs. These guys should be back before the financial report and we'll be able to pull off another mission. So when we come back next time, we will definitely be pulling off another mission against the clans. If we can find something here that we can do. Done, Test the new mechs out. Um, I think there's a few things that we can do in this planet and then we'll jump to another one. Um, Hopefully like a three and a half skull planet where we can definitely find something that we can do go against the clans at a relatively higher level, like three and a half, four skull, I think. We're definitely ready for that. Maybe even four and a half, we'll see. Um, but yeah, we're going to end, end the episode here. If you'd like to drop a like, uh, if you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe and drop any comments in the comment section down below. And until late next time, we'll see you later.